Oh, oh my. One more. Good. Oh man. Go. What the? Oh my goodness. What is happening there? That's pretty cool, man. October, in case you didn't know, is National Bullying Prevention Month. Bullying seems to be a problem. It just kind of never goes away. You know, it's always there. You feel like you're alone if you're if you're suffering from it. Johnny Morris in the house, owner of Aspire Martial Arts. We're here to teach you, teach the kids, get some help out there. Johnny, how you doing? I'm doing good. Kids, how are you? Good. good. Look at you. Say hi to the people over there. Huh? Hey, everyone. You got your friends over there and everything else. Uh, how big is this problem, really? Because I know you get a lot of people coming into to your place, and they're like, hey, man, we're having these problems at school. Help me out. It's a way bigger problem than people think it is. Really? It's really huge. Uh, on study show, about 25 million families are traumatized by bullying in the United sure. States. Wow. So. That, that's unreal. Uh, you're helping the kids here. We have these kids over here. And what do they ask you when they come in the first time? What's the number one thing the kids say to you? Not the parents, but the kids. The kids are looking for fun. Really? The kids are looking for fun. The kids are looking for fun. Parents look for something else, though. Yeah. What yeah. do they look Confidence. for? Confidence. Confidence. Yeah, that's important, kids. isn't it? Uh, so, so how do you help the kids? What's the, the first couple of lessons? What are those lessons all about? To believe in themselves. Our yeah. motto at our studio is, yes, I can. So, and we believe cool. our best uh, confidence is self-defense confidence. Yes. Uh, I see the ages here. I'm not, I'm, I'm shooting for like, what, middle school? Is this middle school These age? These are our middle school ages. Are you middle school kids? You know, yes. Eh, I'm, I'm not good at the ages anymore. Uh, so is that about the age groups or do you teach all kids? We teach all kids. We start at the age of okay. three, actually. Oh, wow. Uh, what types of bullying do you see um, in terms of what is happening? Is it physical? Is it like emotional? You got the online stuff with the social media now. What are you seeing? What do you hear from the kids? Right now, it's all, all bullying. Really? Oh, it's all bullying. So, Manny, what type of bullying do we have? Two types of bullying are physical and verbal bullying. Okay. And, and what, the, what does that mean? So, physical bullying would be like you're getting pushed around by someone. Someone's hitting you. Yeah. You're getting physically attacked. Verbal bullying is when someone's using their words to try to hurt you. Don't do that. Uh, by the way, I'd introduce these guys. Wyatt Evans, hi Wyatt. Hi. Madeline Michael, hi Madeline. Hello. Say hi, so rude, right? Hello. Uh, okay, so what kind of bullying, how do you uh, interpret bullying? Like, can, can it be on social media too? Is that a new thing? Because I'm too old for the whole social media bullying thing, <laughs> but apparently that's a big deal at your age. So yeah, that's called cyberbullying, and oh. that's where um, kids are being attacked, or even adults, sure. through um, social media. Wow. Uh, you talked about confidence a lot, and, and it's very important to go out there and, and walk like I tell my kids, you know, walking around, like, walk like you own the joint. You know what I mean? Like, yes. be confident, keep your eyes open, and that kind of thing. So what do you tell the kids? We know we have a demo here about confidence and walking. Explain that to me. Well, one of our, our things is act like you own, like you said, right? So yeah. we tell our kids at school to make sure you walk with your head up, yes. your body posture, so you're less likely to get bullied. The bully is looking for somebody that's when we have a weak right, posture, right, right. a weak voice. Why not? So we have Paul Michael right here, who's walking. Go ahead, Paul, turn around again. Paul, so you can see his head's up, his shoulders are back. Right. Great body posture. Dude, that's a huge backpack. What's up with that? What are you going, hiking the Himalayas? Holy mackerel, how many books you got in that thing? It looks heavy. Really light. I'm distracted <laughs> by the giant backpack, but okay. Uh, in, in terms of the confidence, so you tell them, always look around, make eye contact with people, and like smile at people when they yes. walk by to say hi, instead of kind of the looking down, shying yes, away from, from the world around you type that's of thing. That's correct. Uh, yeah, that's really important. What happens, uh, Johnny, if, if it gets physical? Because sometimes maybe somebody doesn't, for some reason, starts pushing you mm -hmm. or doing something you don't like. What do you do then? You have to defend yourself. Yeah. You have to defend yourself. I mean, one of the worst things to do is get hurt at school. Yeah. All right. Uh, so right now, what we have is, thanks to you, we have a, a bad scenario. We have Maddie on top. She's the bully. And then we have Brown on the bottom. So the first thing she doesn't want to do is get hit in the face. Right. She's got so to go protect your head, protect your face. Right. Uh, she's going to go ahead now and buck her hips up at the right time. Now, oh. as she lands down, she's going to go ahead and wrap her arm all the way around. And then she's gonna go ahead and she's gonna close her leg up, trap it, and she's gonna flip her over. Oh, Good. wow. She's gonna press down. Whoa. She steps up, and then she can de-escalate this, this situation. Wow. Hey, is that pretty easy to teach? Yes. Not that I'm gonna do it, because, you know, I've got a suit on and whatever, but that's pretty easy to teach. It seems like it's a couple of basic moves. You learn those, you're pretty good. Yes. Yeah? Yes, sir. Oh, my goodness. I, I want to get all this information up for people. It's the 11th Annual Bully Awareness Workshop. This is happening tomorrow. Yes, sir. Okay, on Saturday from noon to 1.30, Aspire Martial Arts. It's in El Cajon. All the information we posted at fox5sandiego.com. If you want, you have to register for the workshop, Johnny, or, or what do you want? Yes, have? if you can go, just go okay. to El, uh, bullyproofelcajon.com. Outstanding. Kids, do you have to go to school today? Yes. 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 I said, kids, do you have to go to school today? Yes. yes. All, yeah, well, now it's all like, yes, sir.
No, it's, it's okay, you all can relax. What's your favorite subject? Uh, mine is math. Math? Anybody like English? Yeah, like reading and stuff? Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, good. Kids, thank you for coming. Is your backpack heavy? Do you mind if I try it on? Come here. We'll be right back in a second, but I want to try this kid's backpack on because it's way too, bro, this is too big. Do they not have lockers anymore? <laughs> Do you kids not have lockers anymore? Uh, you guys, thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, watch me walk away confident. Ready? Here's how you do it, kids. Oh my God, it's too heavy. All right, we'll be right back. Thank you, guys.